people have been shot in Savannah in the past 48 hours. Two of them died. Are any of these shootings connected? Could they be gang related? In our top story tonight, News 3's Chris Williford took those questions to our crime expert and she is joining us now with what she found out. Ten people shot at five different locations. One of the victims, just 16 years old. So far, no information has been released about any suspects in these shootings. We created this map so you can see exactly where all this violence happened. Most of these locations are only a few miles apart. It began Monday night at the Colonial Village Apartments on White Bluff Road. Three people were shot there, and the string of shootings ended last night on Damascus Road. Four people were shot here. Two of the victims, 27-year-old Devontae Hennigan and another male, were killed. It's really a lot, and so when you're looking at from an investigative standpoint, obviously the first thing that jumps out is the timeline and, and the close uh, that all of these are happening within basically a 24, 48 hour period. So you would make the assumption that they are related. It could simply be retaliation and whether that's a formal gang or not, people are acting on behalf of others. So that in fact makes it somewhat gang related. But again, we don't know that. 27 year old Deontay Jones and 28 year old Michael McDaniel were also shot last night on Damascus Street. They were transported to the hospital. No word yet on their conditions. If you know anything about any of these shootings, you're asked to call the violent crimes tip line. That number 912-525-3124. Trish Willow for WSAV News 3.